Hi guys, it's Julie from cookedbyjulie.com and today we're making Cuban shrimp creole. Succulent shrimp packed with flavor. I absolutely love it and I wanted to share the recipe with you all. Let's get started. The first thing you want to do is add some oil to your skillet and heat that over medium high heat. Add the onions and peppers, cook it for three to four minutes or until translucent. Once the onions and peppers are translucent, go ahead and stir in the fresh garlic. Make sure to add a generous amount. And then the spices. I added tassong, oregano, a bay leaf, salt, and pepper. Tassong isn't really traditional in this dish, but I just like to add a little bit because it adds flavor. This part is optional, but I love to add white wine, preferably Pinot Grigio. If you don't have white wine, add some dry white cooking wine or a splash of vinegar. Let the wine reduce by half. It should take about a minute and then add the tomato sauce and water. Check for seasoning, season generously with salt and pepper. Let the sauce come up to a simmer. Once it comes up to a simmer, add the capers, hot sauce, and shrimp. I use raw, peeled, and deveined shrimp. Feel free to leave the tails on. I always recommend leaving the tails on. It makes the shrimp appear larger, and also a lot of the garlic and spices like to sneak in the tail. So much flavor. But for some reason, I felt like removing the tails off for this recipe. All right, once you add the shrimp, go ahead and cover it and let it cook for two minutes or until the shrimp turn pink. Garnish with fresh cilantro, serve with white rice, and that's pretty much it. Such a quick and delicious meal, perfect for a busy weeknight. Go on over to my website, cookedbyjulie.com, for the complete recipe and more detail. Make this recipe, let me know if you do, and I want to thank you guys so much for watching.